Hi, it's AI Darren here. Welcome back to Ask the Instructor, presented by Campus Mortgage. Today's question is, when validating the borrower's social security number, both the W-2 and credit report have differing information. What is the most reliable document that you should be using when comparing these two for accuracy? Here is what our mortgage instructor has to say. When reviewing a new loan application, you will find that sometimes the customer will have provided their social security card for you to review against the file. It is not a requirement to have a copy of the actual social security card in file. Therefore, if this document is not in the file and a social security number discrepancy occurs, the easiest and most accurate way to cure the issue is to have the borrower execute a form SFA-89. This form is then sent to the IRS for verification that the social security number is correct and that it belongs to the borrower. This concludes our one minute video. If you like this video, please help us by clicking the like button and consider subscribing to our channel. And remember, at Campus Mortgage, we offer a variety of comprehensive mortgage training and certification programs. To learn how we can help jumpstart your mortgage career, simply download our course catalog at campusmortgage.org. Thank you and make it a great day.